Hello everyone. In today's video, we are going to talk about do you need coding skills to become an AWS solutions architect? Myself, Mohammed Zubair, and this channel is all about showing you how to become a highly paid IT pro really fast. So without any further ado, let's get started. Well, before we jump to our question, we should understand what AWS is and what different services are provided by it. AWS or Amazon Web Services is a comprehensive platform that provides cloud computing services, including platform as service, infrastructure as service, and software as a service. In general, AWS offers the organization ability and tools for computations, content delivery and database storage services. And now let's understand what an AWS solution architect does. The prime responsibility of a solution architect is to provide the customer with advice on their needs and goals, review the architecture and manage the cloud computing architecture of the company. Along with that, the AWS solution architect is supposed to perform some other duties that include architecting, building and keeping the scalable cloud environment for the organization, understanding the business goal, and then creating the cloud solution based on that, and then keeping the cloud environment secure and prevention of the security breaches and downtime. And there are many other jobs of the same nature. Now let's come to our question. Well, in short, the answer is not. We do not need coding skills to become an AWS solution architect. There are a lot of jobs and tasks that can be performed without coding. In some circumstances, we do not need to have coding skills and AWS get interacts either through clicking on AWS UI or writing small program and script to perform some actions. You can easily create AWS infrastructure with UI or user interface and without any code. For example, you can deploy servers, create virtual machines, create instance, and can access any AWS services image without writing a single line of code. Everything gets done by the use of a user interface. There are many tasks that can be performed without coding. WordPress website creation is a prevalent task for how AWS gets used, file storage on AWS, etc. Now, if we talk about the long answer, Yes, there are some job roles where you do require to have coding skills. Even in coding, we have two types of coding. In AWS, application coding and infrastructure codings are there. Application coding is a type of coding that we do for the automation of repetitive tasks, etc. And it bases on the logic, for example, the use of if-else statement, switch statement, etc. On the other hand, if we talk about the infrastructure coding, as the name suggests, it is primarily dedicated to the sole task of writing and configuration of infrastructure. We don't use much logic in our infrastructure coding as we simply use a set of instructions while coding it. Here we need to understand what type of task in AWS requires you to have coding skills and knowledge while creating custom websites creation of custom APIs, etc. And one bonus tip here is that having a bit of grip on Python and Java programming language is good thing and always beneficial. Now to conclude this video and summarize whether we need coding skills to become an AWS architect or not, I would say it all depends on the job nature and the duties you will perform. If you want to become a cloud engineer or work on the cloud itself, then you should have work with infrastructure and for that coding is needed at the same time. There are some tasks that do not require you to have any coding skill. So in the longer run, it is better to have coding skill, but to kickstart your career, you can start without it as well. And that brings us to the end of today's video. If you have anything to ask, please leave a comment below. I'll get back to you in the next video. Till then, take care.